now that I'm not streaming on Amazon, I don't have to worry about what I stream anymore. So I can actually show my 3D modeling process. I can show my 3D printing process. I can show everything now. I forget about this. I've, I've been streaming on Amazon for the past five years. And, well, I guess I should say four. Because it was 2019, but at the end. So I've been streaming on Amazon for the past four years. And I'm so conditioned now to what I can and can't stream anymore. That now that I'm not on Amazon anymore, I forget that I can actually do things. I can actually play video games. I can, I can 3D model and show you guys. I was the very first Amazon live streamer ever. I was the first person to stream on Amazon live. So Amazon live, for people who are just joining or just now watching, Amazon live is like, um, it's like, it's like live streaming for Amazon, but like infomercials. So they want you to do like infomercial live streaming on Amazon itself. Um, and I really don't like doing that. It just doesn't feel right for me. I have a hard time being infomercially. I'm a free spirit. Now that I don't have to worry about the rules and regulations of Amazon live streaming, I can do whatever I want. I forget about this. You guys will probably have to remind me until I get used to it again. Because it's so engraved in my brain now that I'm not allowed to play video games. I'm not allowed to show programs that... I'm not allowed to show anything that's not Amazon. So, you guys will have to remind remind me. <laughs> wait, wait, where'd your comment go? I lost it. I'm so glad you're no longer on Amazon. I'm sure it was great to learn from, but... Yeah, exactly. I can... I can let my wings fly. I'm a free bird. I can play video games. I don't have to be scared. It's weird. Also, the fact that... Like, the fact that, like, fear was even stopping me... Because when I first started Amazon Live, like I said, I was the first Amazon Live streamer. When I first started, they allowed us to play video games. They pretty much told us what they... Okay, this is the original... Like, originally how Amazon Live started. They basically wanted it to be like Twitch. But then they wanted us to occasionally, like, show our computers. Or show our, like, show our furniture. Or show, like, our clothes. And basically, that's what they wanted. So they wanted us to do, like, pretty much whatever I'm doing. Like, whatever. But they just wanted me to occasionally be like, oh, I got this product. Kind of like a more genuine thing. And so originally at the beginning of Amazon Live, um, it was perfect. I loved it. It was great because I was like, I already like helping people. So, and I worked at GameStop. So for me, I was like, this is amazing. I can play video games. And if somebody has a question about like the Nintendo Switch well, I'm talking about whatever, I will get out my Nintendo Switch and I will tell you everything about it because I already love doing that. And so, for me at the time, the first Amazon Live, how Amazon Live used to be, it was perfect. I absolutely loved it. And then, yeah, and then it evolved, and now it's pretty much like they just want infomercials. And now I fell out of love with it.